You are now watching a Lucky Penny Shop product feature. Hey, it's Lucky Penny, Penny Shop. Shop. Elise and I are doing another crafting art project together. Yes, we are. Now, you picked this one out. I gave you four to choose from. Mm -hmm. And this was one of your top sets. Do you know where I got this? Uh, from a garage sale. Yeah, actually. garage sale. Now you see the five dollar price tag. I don't think I paid five. I think I bought three or four sets from uh, this particular garage sale and said, okay. "Hey, would you take ten? And I got a better deal on all of them in one big package here. This was cool. only at Target. Mold and paint your own magical characters. Now we were talking about this. It's going to take a little while because we have to actually mold the two characters and then yes. let them dry. So this might happen over a couple days. Why don't you spin that box around? Okay. Very good. All right. Let's see. It says, includes everything you need. So that's in the bottom left corner. Creative roots. Creative roots. Hmm. Not sure what that means. Yeah, me neither. Everything you need to make two magical characters. So you get two molds. You probably get the mix, a bowl to mix it in, all the paints, paintbrush, some sparkles, and then the actual snow globe bases, huh? Okay. All right. You think you're going to want to do this one? Yes. Well, you have to now because we just it? started. So <laughs> when we come back, we'll be opening the box and checking out all the pieces. Okay. All right. Here we go. You know what? I didn't see the age requirement on this one. Are you old enough? Yes, I am. This is for ages six plus. Okay. You definitely qualify for that. Yes. Take that. Look at that. They got this huge piece of tape running across the whole thing. Can you open that bag? And then there's tape holding each of these on. Should I take the stuff out of it? Yeah, go ahead. Okay, okay so this is a mold number one. That looks like the little fairy, I think that one is. What do you got? A paintbrush, a mixer. And then this looks like a little, I don't know, what is that? A little bird. It's a little bird. An owl. Yeah, it's an owl. <laughs> Maybe if I show it this way, you'll be able to see it better. Okay, that's that. And I gotta get the plaster mix now. I don't wanna do that. Oh, one of the bags is open. All right, okay. so there's just a little powder. We're gonna make a mess today. Yes, okay. I'm gonna go ahead and take the paint out of the bag so we're all set. Oh, okay, so this is the snow globe. Ah, I see. Now your actual piece is actually inside here, but the water's gonna sit on the outside, it looks like. Me, Ooh, and that's what seals it. I can't really do oh, it with wow. my hands. There you go. Thank you. So there's two of these, and they just clip on like that. They don't even clip on, they just sit in there. Do you get what I'm saying now? So your yes. piece that you color, the piece that you color and decorate, never touches the water. Just this outside area. Where's the glitter for the snow globe? Was well, that it there? Is right in here. All right. What else do we have in there? Yes. Oh, those are probably the little locks down here. Oh. Okay. Oh. We're yeah. learning without reading Four the instructions. Okay, one for each. All right. So we know how that's gonna work. Is there like? I don't know. What is it? It's some kind of like uh, fabric or something. And then the glitter. Ooh, the glitter. We need the glitter, right? Mm -hmm. That's going to make the snow mm -hmm. in your snow globe. Yes. Gloves, it looks like. Yes, gloves. Okay. So and here's our mixing bowl. And here's the caps. Okay. Mm -hmm. So each gets a cap. Each gets that. All right. So we will study. Okay. And then we will come back and read. And then we will start. So we'll be right back with some water. We're going to have to mix this up, make our two shapes, then let it sit probably a day. We'll see and come back and finish it up. So let's come right back with the water. All right. All right. Water. Check. Yes. Then they said safety mask. That was in the bag. So show everybody the safety mask. Okay. Check. It's got little bands around it to put over your ears. And then the gloves. They don't want you to breathe in any Check. of... Very good. Any of the powder. Okay, take the mixing tray and add warm water, approximately 2.37 ounces, up to the level marked on the mixing tray as shown in diagram one. So if you look at this mixing tray, there is a lower section there, and that's where the water needs to go to. Now we brought in a backup one so we can do both. So take that now, let's see, right up to the line. Let's see, is that good? A little bit more. Uh, yeah. Okay, now pour that into here. So then I have the correct amount of water on this side. OK. 
Okay. Yep. That one's set. We're going to get yours going first. So while you're mixing, then I'll start mine because then we have a little bit of extra time. Okay. Okay. All right. Now, let me get some scissors. You are going to be mixing right here. Are you ready? Get your I'm mixer ready. ready. Okay. Let's see if I can pick it up. <laughs> <laughs> you look like a doctor. Yeah, Got your do doctored mask on. Okay. So we'll hold the tray right about there and gento. They want the whole bag in there. Oh. Now you can't take too long because it'll set right in here and it's going to make a sludgy mixture that we can pour into the shape. Okay, can you do both? Can you hold the bowl and mix at the same time? Yes, I There you go. So. so we're going to let you get started. This they want to make sure is pressed in all the points and then it's made so that there's a hole on the top here and then this sits flat so it'll go like that and we're going to pour it right in when you think you're ready. Okay. Let me know when you think you got it. We'll clean off a little bit of the edge. Okay. okay. Well, kind of got it on the table. But... That's all right. Looks like you're ready to go though. Here, let's see. Let me see if there's anything around the edges. Ready? I mean, there's, there's a little a few bit in there, yeah. Crumbs, yeah. I would hold it up straight like this, see, and then, like cake batter, you want to get the mix. Now, when they said pour it, you don't want to make too many bubbles, so you don't want to mix like crazy. Okay. So you don't want air in there, and it only said it takes about a half hour to dry, so. Hmm. Okay. Do you want to hold it or do you want to pour it? Mm. <laughs> uh, I'm very messy pouring it, so I guess I'll hold it. <laughs> Alright, so you hold that. And I'm going to try to pour this into the hole. Yeah, hold it kind of like that so everybody can see it going in. Alright, you ready? Mm -hmm. Here we go. Number one. Maybe that does both. I don't know. It looks like it, doesn't it? Mm -hmm. Give it a little tap down. Gentle. Wow, I think it's I think one mix yeah. will do both, don't you? Mm-hmm. A little bit more. Okay. There we go. So will it stand up on its own? I think so. Here, we'll lean it against this. Oh, so we don't have to mix a whole nother batch. Yeah, that's pretty nice. Let's go this way. Okay. Okay. It's I perfect. know. I don't trust it either. Do you trust it? <laughs> no. I don't trust it. Let's lean this up against it. Get some pressure on it. I still don't trust it, but we got to move quick here. So hold that one like that. All right. Let me mix this up again. Yeah, they didn't say that. Yeah, I know. Double check all these are pressed in. Good. Here we go. Number two. I see some lumps. Yeah, I do. It's not supposed to be leaking out the bottom, though. Make sure that's pressed in down here. Okay. Let me top it off just a little. All right, so these are done. When they dry, we can come back. We'll find a nice place to store them. Okay. And then we'll get them out of the mold. So we'll be back. All right. All right. Elise and I are back. It's yeah. been a good 30, 35 minutes or longer, like they said. <laughs> now, why don't we check? Now, they say to cut here, 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 and here. Uh, I'm not sure why. I can cut mine and we'll see if it makes a difference. Here, we'll do that. Okay. It says cut this this way. Okay. Then this end off this way. Oh, pieces going everywhere. They missed this way. So they don't want you to reuse these, I guess, huh? Mm, I guess not. Well, let's see. Does that make a difference? I mean, and then peel this apart because now they did say after this they do need to sit overnight. Okay. Oh, I'm nervous. You nervous? Oh, oh, Ooh. look at that. That worked pretty. That worked out pretty well. Yeah. Mm-hmm. You think it's safe? We should cut yours? Yeah, sure. 
Okay, we can let that sit. Let's let that down sit. All right, we're gonna officially ruin it. Everybody want to see yours. Yours came out really nice, huh? Yes, it did. And that's the back side. So we made sure we actually added a little bit extra here and there to fill in the little yes. pocket that we noticed later. I'm gonna let you peel this one. So it's all in your yeah. hands after this. Just I'll don't try. cut yourself on the plastic. I can, whoa. Whoa, that one ricocheted. Yeah. <laughs> wow, so shooting everywhere. One. Okay, so there you go. Just slowly start going around the edges. Oops, mine's popping out. We don't want to rush it now. We've gotten this far, huh? Mm -hmm. There. Okay, so that we'll have to trim these off after this dries a little. Okay, yeah, try to pull it so that it's from this side. Yeah, there over that edge, yeah. Okay, here, watch. I want to pull the bigger sides apart mm. from this way. Okay. See? Oh, yeah. So finish that. So you wouldn't put pressure on. There you go. Okay. Now just take your hands from here and just kind of, yeah. Okay. You should be able to grab it now gentle and from like here and pull it out. Nope, 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 nope. As soon as you hit resistance. Oh. Okay, see now if you can carefully pull, pull from here and here at the same time. Gentle, there you go. Okay, so I'll show everybody yours. Here, I'll tell you what, we'll put the camera in real low here. Set it next to that one. Okay, so now they need to sit. And it uh, looks like we're going to have to clean up around here, huh? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Made a good mess. Mm -hmm. All right, so we'll see you tomorrow. Okay. Doing okay there? Mm -hmm. I think I lost one of his ears. Uh-oh. Yeah, <laughs> must have come off in the packaging. I mean, when I was taking it out of the plastic. Yep, it did. Or I cut it, I don't remember. Mm -mm. Is this it right here? Is this his ear? Yeah, I might be able to glue yeah. this back on. Okay, oh, yeah. we'll worry about that later. Okay. You're doing pretty good. Okay, I think I'm happy with that. All cleaned up. How you doing? Good. Okay. Oh, I think I want to flatten out that piece. Glad we're doing this now while it's soft. Mm -hmm. It would probably crack if we were doing Yeah, harder to do. Hard. Okay, so I have his ear. I think I can save it. Yay. I'll put a little super glue on that ear after it dries. Okay. Just a few You're all set? Here and there. Okay, now. We'll Good. Yes. Perfect. All right. All right, we are back. Yes. It's been a full day now. Mm -hmm. Did you notice I glued my ear back on? Yeah, I did. So I was able to save that. And now we need to decorate. Now this is the sparkles that goes inside the domes and then we each have a water. I'm going to give you a little mixing palette if you need that. I'll change the camera in a second if we want to. Well, well let's do this. I'll open these. Okay. And I'll just have them all ready for us. Sounds good. Are you ready? I'm ready, yes. Okay. Now remember, it only came with one paintbrush, so I'm going to bring in my own brush. Okay. And I am going to get started with my owl. So you start there, okay. and I'll change the camera a little bit. Let's just see if we can get, get the painting going. I'm just going to paint my whole base one color. What about you? Uh, yeah, I will. 
All right, so here's what we're gonna do because this this is gonna take probably a good hour, 45 minutes to an hour. Maybe yes. So we'll keep checking back. We won't record the whole thing. Although I said that the last few times, and guess what we did? We recorded the whole thing. Oh yeah. <laughs> it was on the paper folding one. Remember that one? Yeah, I remember that one. Like, oh, we'll just keep checking back, and then we ended up with an hour, 45 minute video. I'm doing like a tree stump, that's why. And then oh, I'll, add, cool. I'll add some green, like, bushes around my owl. Good idea. And the whole base? Yeah, I'll try. There. That's one side. I'll let that dry a little bit. I'll check this out. Actually, look at that. It's not bad. A little bit longer. Take a little of this water and get my hands clean. You just keep going there. I messed up on my eyes. Now they're all brown. It looks like she's a demon. <laughs> no, it doesn't. It's fine. I don't think it looks like a demon. I'm giving my owl yellow eyes. Okay. It doesn't really coat very well over the other color. Mm -hmm. There he is. Alright, and I think I want to get some color down here on the bottom. There's little flowerettes all around. I have no idea what I'm painting.
Okay, well, I'm pretty much done. You're done? So. Can you slide it over? Put it over here by that one, yes. And then move in your, move in your plastic base now. I'll give you a little bit more distance there. And go ahead and do that. I can't wait to get mine together. Mm -hmm. You gotta kinda goop it up on there to get it. So take it like this, and you gotta put more color on there to stick to the plastic. Oh, you need a little paper towel. Why don't you tell me you need a paper towel? That's how you dry off your brush. <laughs> All right, we are back. And we are ready to show you our two figures and the bases. So yes. let me just zoom in a little bit. Okay. Now we thoroughly let these dry. So now just turn it slightly so they can see all the sides. Now we okay. neither of us did the backs of our snow globes, right? No, yes, that is correct. And they dried for a while, so we are good to go. We don't have to worry about paint. All right, one more turn to the side. Okay, and then one more turn around. So now it's a matter of just getting them in the bases and the tops. Okay, let me get the camera set up here. So what we want to do now is take your top, turn it upside down. Right. Now stick your character in there. Okay. Yours fits better than mine, huh? Mm -hmm. I hope I can get my piece on. Okay, now take your base. Okay. Now which way is your front? So yep, so this is your front and this is my front, so now you put this over it. Got to be nice and even. Okay, you're not, yeah, you got to get it nice and straight on. There you go. Okay, thank you. Now take these square pieces and push them in place and that will lock that to that. Okay, then turn it around, okay. and now they should be set to add the liquid. Let's give a nice close-up of them. All right, so we're going to do something a little bit different with the liquid. Now, these are the caps, so these don't go on until we get the liquid in. So let's get that set. We're going to put water in mine and tonic water in yours, right? Yes. So let's come back, pour it in, and we'll explain why. Here we go. Time for the water. We're going to do mine first. Okay. You are in charge of the funnel. You are the funnel holder. Okay. And I am the filler. Here we go. Lift it up just a little. You're pressing on the... There you go. It was creating a... Like a okay. suction on the top. Well, thank you for telling me. 
I'm sure you would have figured it out eventually, right? As I was yeah, yeah, overfill yeah. it. Ooh, look at that. That's going to be fun. Mm -hmm. Shaking it. Okay, say when. Yeah. Woo! All right, now, it says a pinch of sparkle. Now, I gave you a little bag with a little spoon, so get that open. Hey, it shouldn't be leaking. Mine's leaking from there. Hmm. There might be a defect in the plastic. Mm -hmm. I can't believe it. Yeah, just spoon in a little bit. That's about a pinch. Yeah, that's good. Okay. Put that in. Then we will seal it up. I hope yours isn't leaking. Mm -hmm. Okay. It says you could put more, uh, but be best results. Hmm. Oh. Look how bad it's leaking. Yeah, yeah. All right, let me check. All right, tell you what. Let's leave this one. I'll have to come back to this one, but I'll get this on. Then we'll come back. I probably got to really pinch this on, huh? Mm-hmm. Okay, that's it. Let me just shake it around and see. Oh, okay. okay. I think a pinch is not enough, but yeah. We'll try and we'll jump oh, there, and I see it all floating oh, yeah. around there. You see it in there? Yeah, I see it. All right. I tell you what. Let's get yours set up next. Okay. Let's get a paper towel. Bring yours in. Don't know why it's leaking. Yeah. yeah. Hmm. We're gonna have to investigate that. All right, so to tonic water. Why do we want to do tonic water? Because we're trying to see if it will glow. Yeah. All right, so I will do this. You know, maybe I could just pour it from this. If you hold the funnel again, okay. and hopefully yours isn't going to leak. Here, we'll get a nice close up of the filling. This might have bubbles too. Mm -hmm. So we might have to let this one sit a little bit. Ooh, that was it's right careful. at the top. Okay, so far so good. I don't see any leaks on yours. Now mine stopped leaking, so I wonder if it was just pressure. Maybe. I do want to put more sparkle. This time in yours, put a nice big spoonful. We haven't leaked any. Now, of course, they say use distilled water. Mm-hmm. Not tonic water. Okay? This is experimenting, but we could just empty the water, right? Mm -hmm. You basically put anything in the snow globe you want. Okay. Ooh, that might be too much. Mm -hmm. I'll tell you what, let me soak a little bit out of there. Okay. And then I'll just use this. Get ready for your... There, yeah, it looks good. I think you need a little bit of air in a snow globe, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, put in a nice couple scoops. At least one big scoop here. I'll hold this. Okay. There you go. Nice big scoop. Mm, yep. Yeah, shake it off. There you go. Wait. Let me pinch this better. Okay. Oh, wait. You're going to try? Hold on. Let me, let me try the funnel. Okay. I think that's a better <laughs> idea. It's going to get all over the table. Okay. The most important part is that little funnel tube. Mm-hmm. And then we'll fix mine. Okay, I think we're okay. Okay. Are you ready? I'm ready. Go ahead. Oh, nice, nice. Okay, that's quite a bit more. Mm -hmm. All right, and we're going to want to clear those bubbles out. They'll eventually go away, but you got it? Okay. All right, yours is leaking too in the front. Hmm. I wonder why. Yeah, go ahead. Tilt yours upside down and get your stuff moving around. Oh, yeah, look at that. That looks cool. Let me do it from the top. Yeah, it's all built up right there. Yeah, so give it a little spin. Turn it upside down. There you go. That'll move it all around. I'm going to put a little bit more in mine. Good idea. All right. There we go.
That's okay. Yeah. How about you just we'll just let it settle. Okay. Let's turn off the lights. Mine's lumping up too on the inside. Mm -hmm. Oh, there we go. That's much better. Let's turn off the lights and then we'll see what it looks like in the dark and we'll shine a flashlight through it too. That'll be neat the way to see so you could see it better. Okay. All right, we are in the back and I have to say it is glowing really cool. Mm -hmm. Now, I think uh, the glitter, though, is not working too well on yours, is it? Yeah, it isn't. Let me twist mine around. You can just tell the difference in the waters, right? Mm -hmm. Even this one, the glitter is bunching up at the top. And then they're still leaking, so we're going to have to figure that out. I might have yeah. to seal those with some super glue. Turn yours over and slowly just do that and that, and then we'll see. Yeah, see, not much. But I do like the glowing effect. I think that's mm -hmm. pretty cool. I think over time... The bu bubbles will clear, completely clear yeah. out, or you just use flat soda. You shake it up and you get all the fizz out. That would work better. Mm -hmm. All right, so let's come back. We have seen them now. It's hard to see the figures inside here. Let me put a little light on this and see if we can see the glitter, the sparkly. It's happening. Mm -hmm. You almost need the sun. See mm -hmm. it all floating yeah, around in there? It. How's that? All right, we'll be right back. We'll turn the lights on and we'll you know, give our final thoughts. Okay. All right, we are back. That was pretty cool. Mm -hmm. I would say it was a 50-50 fail. Pretty neat effect. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. All right, so what did we decide to do? We decided to pour this out yes. and fill it with water. Okay, so we're going to try and show everybody how easy it is to do. So we need to bring in a cup. Okay. And then you just take this and... Bloop, 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 bloop. See how easy that is? We will have to dump that one out, huh? And we'll still have our extra. Yeah, look, and it's all in there still. All right, funnel for you, and then water. Here we go, regular water now. It looks like there's still just a little bit of the uh, yeah, just a little tonic bit. water in there. That's pretty cool. Mm hmm Look, I can keep a nice steady amount in your funnel. Say when. Say when. When. Right? Uh, when. A little bit more? Yeah, I get a little bit more. Yeah, you didn't realize how much when. I had. <gasps> <gasps> that was close. Mm -hmm. We went over. You were right. All right, let me just take some of that out. Okay. Give it a little air. Okay, and then cap it up. We're gonna have to clean this up a little bit, huh? Yeah. We got water, they're leaking. Okay. All right, so now, just take it and kind of go whoosh, whoosh. Is that better? Mm-hmm. Ah, yeah, oh, look at yay. that. yay, it's working. Cool. Let me get a nice close-up of that. So now, we'll give it a quick shake. At the same time, one, Two and three. There you go. Perfect. Mm -hmm. Let me drop the lighting down just a little bit. We'll do that one more time. Ready? And one. And a two. And a three. Go. A little bit in the center. Right there. Okay. okay. All right. One more time. Now we want to end up right here. You ready? One, yes. two, and three. There you go. That looks much better now. Mm-hmm. All right, there you go. So make your own sparkle globes. What do you think about that? It was really fun. Pretty yes, fun. Pretty fun. And then uh, we have a couple leaks, so we'll have to oh, figure yeah. that out. Okay. And it's always fun experimenting, right? Mm -hmm. Now I wonder what you could put inside. Take out the figure and maybe put something else in there, huh? Yeah, yeah. Because there is uh, the option now, and uh, now that the figure isn't getting wet, it shouldn't be. I'm going one more time. Are you ready? Sit. Go. Perfect. <laughs> and thanks for watching, everybody. If you want to see more cool videos, look in that description for a playlist. Or as always, you can search Lucky Penny Shop. Later. Bye. One more time. Gotta just keep doing it. That's the only way snow globes work. <laughs> if you're looking for the item you just saw in the video, click here. Watch more videos by clicking oh. here. Don't forget to share on social media and give a thumbs up. Hey, LPS Dave. What's up, Butch? Make sure they don't forget to subscribe. Oh, yeah. Please click here to subscribe to Lucky Penny Shop. And always remember when you see a lucky penny, pick it up.